Hey guys, Gummetcher Zero here. Got plays Minecraft. Welcome back to my world here with my friend Shadow Lich. Hello, Shadow. Hello. And I want to show you another thing that I built here. And uh, this was actually partially inspired by uh, uh, my friend Jay, who does a channel called QB Craft, and he he did something uh, with a uh, portal that I thought was really cool, where he put the portal into a demon's mouth. And uh, so uh, Shadow and I talked about it, and we recognize the fact that our town has been naughty. It has been a very naughty town, and we required a chapel. And so we have built a chapel, but as all things get muncherish, you will notice, if you pan down, that this appears to be a chapel, but it's also kind of creepy, because this is like this is like a skull face here, right? And, uh, oh, Shadow... I think your congregant escaped. I think he's been very naughty. No. Are you going to punish him for his for his naughty? Yes. Oh my god. Awesome. <laughs> that was a one shot kill, man. Awesome. <laughs> no nuggets though. He well, failed when you to have a bow this strong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> But as you walk in, if you turn back, you can kind of see a little bit better the skull, the skull here. And I worked a long time on this, so I really want to show this off. So, so as you come in the door, uh, here's the here's the skull mouth kind of idea, and then here's kind of like a half skull here. And these are the obviously this is the trusses in the roof or whatever, because you know. I know this is Minecraft, but, you know, things need trusses and things to support them, right? Right? They, they should look like it. Because it makes it look like your buildings have more... To me, it makes it look like my buildings have more weight if they kind of obey, you know, natural conventions, like having trusses and things. That's why my bridges always have... If you've ever seen any of the bridges I've made, they always have, have, have arches under them and stuff. And then you get to the altar with Brother Shadow... <laughs> Preach, brother Shadow. Tell me of the, tell me of the terrible Nether. The terrible Nether and the uh, ghasts. The ghasts, yeah, brother. Don't we need to. Re don't think we need to relive the uh, ghasts. The ghasts. They will shoot you in the butt. <laughs> they will burn you. <laughs> they will or knock you off in high places. Of <laughs> Skeletons do that now too. So it will uh, knock you down. <laughs> you will go down into the fiery depths of the Nether and burn for eternity, or until all your stuff goes snap, crackle, pop, and disappears. Yay, yay! Here is the demon face that leads into my that leads into my Nether regions. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, this with, has got a new with thing. The blood stained this walls. With the bloodstained walls. There's blood leading right up to it. And this has got a new block. What is that called? I forget. The uh, magma block? Yeah. And The magma block. And this is all gold that we personally took out of... Uh, we beat out of our congregation. <laughs> uh, I love it. I love yeah, it. Yeah, this is nice. And so this is kind of like a demon face here. So, hey, hey, Jay, if you're watching this video, thanks. Shout out, buddy. I love your channel. And uh, pretty soon, Shadow Lich is getting his own channel. He's he's working on that. Pretty soon, we're going to be in his in his videos. That'll be awesome. We'll have, sure. We'll have a whole network. <laughs> <laughs> and here is the book. I read now from the Book of Enchantment, Chapter 1. I have nothing. Wait, what can I enchant? Uh, you can't enchant a book. I don't have anything that's not enchanted, so therefore I will not read from the book for him unworthy. <laughs> um, here. Uh, that's all right, man. <laughs> don't worry about it. <laughs> and then we've got, uh, we've got, you know, we've got the pews here going back. Uh, nice little red glass. Shadow said we should use red, and I think that was perfect choice. Yeah. It, it it does look nice, especially with the purple and the portal and the wood choices. And I'm also really happy with this roof, man. Uh, I think the roof turned yeah, out this, great. Yes, it did. I spent a lot of time on that. And uh, 
it's not really that complicated, but it just took a while to get get the numbers right and make it all look like it kind of was proportionate and fit together nicely. And then this is uh, we got some stairs there, fence going up, kind of gives you the illusion. And these are actually backward stairs here, sticking down. That kind of gives you a little reveal back there. I don't know. It all kind of adds up. So as you come up on it, it kind of just looks more like a roof hanging down. And then uh, back here, this would be, I guess, this is probably like behind the altar where the uh, the preacher or the priest or whatever would uh, prepare. That's just pretend windows there. But uh, those had to be pretend because the whole reason this church is here originally was we've got our mega furnace down here where we can cook uh, we can cook stuff our at the speed of amazing. <laughs> yeah, we can cook our congregants. <laughs> Or at least their assets. <laughs> so we've got 16, uh, 16 ovens here. And uh, this side here, you put in uh, fuel. We're using charcoal as our fuel. Or you could use blaze rods or better. They're the fastest, I think. And this makes sure that the fuel gets spread out. And then on this side, you put in uh, whatever it is that you want to cook. Uh, put a couple meat in there. And then you'll see it comes down here, goes through the hoppers, and then it's going to start firing up in these furnaces. And uh, there's a little bit of lag. I think 16 might be too many. On the last world, we had 8. And then the stuff comes back here. There's a dropper tower. And uh, there's a little delay for the first item, you know, and then it's just going to be pop, 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 and stuff just starts coming in. Oh, and then sometimes there's items in the dropper tower because it's not very efficient we tried doing those glass tower what do you call that the glass item elevator that they do but yeah. I can never get it to work I see people do that and see we've already got our first pork chop so we're doing great it is the pork chop of success Huzzah. Here, eat Huzzah. the flesh of the pork. Ah. I will eat the congregant. Nom, nom, nom. <laughs> I'm blessed with the congregant's pure, purifying powers. <laughs> Toxicity. Toxicities, right? So anyway, I hope you liked the video. If you did, if you liked the building, if you liked the video, or if you just think I'm a silly dummy, just go ahead, go ahead and click like below. Subscribe for more. Guts got to go. And I'm going to say thanks for watching. Good night. Goodbye. Bye.